You guys all missed Ina so much, and we are now here. And I dragged with this guy, and we got Emma behind as well. Don't mind the camera, it's just uh, jumping around right now. We have made it to Chile after a long 17 hour flight. We flew from Cabo San Lucas to Atlanta, about three and a half hours layover in Atlanta, and then we flew from straight from Atlanta to Chile. Santiago, Santiago, Chile. So we're gonna be here for the next two weeks or so. So we decided instead of going, calm down. <laughs> instead of going to, I like the glasses. Look at this, I trendy, know, the new look. Glasses. No, no thing on the side. <laughs> instead of going to Miami for Music Week, we thought we would come down, meet Ina down here, and go do some adventures here. And just because, especially because Ivan has never been out of the country, and Mexico was his first time. <laughs> we thought we would bring him down to Chile and show him an experience here. We feel very dirty. We haven't showered or anything, but we're gonna take it for the team. Show your teeth long. with wine. <laughs> yeah, if you guys are wondering why my teeth looks brown or red, it's because I drank red wine on the plane and I now look like I have red teeth that's stained. We're now in Santiago. We'll see you guys in a little bit. And it is the next day here in Santiago, Chile. We took yesterday just for pretty much relaxing, catching up, and reconnecting since I haven't seen Inska in a while. There she is right behind there with Emma. The most important dog in this world. They're definitely the most important dog in the world. Baby Yvonne over here. Hold on. What do you have to say about your video? Super excited. Loved all the comments, all the positive feedback. Might have to start vlogging. Might have to get a camera. Seems like people want back. you to start. I know. I'm like still nervous about doing it, but might have to start soon. Good. Good. Look at how comfortable he is on camera now. It's a changed <laughs> man. And right now we are actually heading to Ina's brother's competition. He's actually taking part in a BMX competition. Pretty cool. He's seeing this is like the qualifying round to see if he can get to finals, which will be on Sunday. So we're gonna go and check out some people doing tricks, and Ivan as well participating in this great event. Yeah, I'm the Love water BMX. boy. Yeah, my brother is gonna go to the finals. Though. You think so? Yeah. He's very good. He's really talented. He showed guys. me a video of him doing a backflip yeah. yesterday, which is crazy. Anyway, we're heading in now. Let's check out what this place is all about and uh, see if we can get some cool videos of him on the bike. You don't love her, but you say so. It's alright, we all got things we don't know I don't even mind Cause I like being by your side I'll be waiting, I'll be patient Till you find your favorite location Perfectly designed For a love to be oh so blind We'll be falling high
back at Ina's spot. As you can see, this doesn't look like my room. I'm actually in Ina's room right now. They are still heading back from the BMX thing. Killed it, did a backflip. I don't know if you guys saw or could notice, but in that video you just saw, that was Christian doing the backflip off of that ramp. Super cool. We'll see what happens and if he gets into the finals. But I thought I would probably end the video off here just because I haven't really done much here in Santiago yet. It's been a lot of just catching up, going out with Ina, just spending time alone together because we haven't seen each other in about a month, which was crazy. She had so much stuff she had to do down here in Santiago and I've been traveling around in the States and then down to Mexico and then coming and meeting her here. So I apologize. This video is a little bit shorter than normal, but we have some amazing stuff planned for the next few days, which we're really excited about here in Chile. But I thought I would end off with a question that I got asked in one of the comments that I think would help a lot of you out if you are travelers or you guys want to travel. And that is how do you guys, how do you guys go about packing your bags everywhere you travel? So for me personally, I actually am probably one of the worst people for this because I use a massive bag that literally, it looks like this bag right here. That's how big it is compared to my foot. But my bag is black, that's Ina's. She carries two bags around when she travels. I travel with one of those, but that bag is really difficult to travel with just because it's so big and that makes it easy because it's big, but at the same time, you keep packing as much stuff into it as possible because you can fit so much stuff. And I don't know if you guys know this, but when you are traveling, you actually are limited to a certain weight. And depending on the travel and depending on where you're going and how nice a booking person is, things like that, it all varies. So for me, my bag traveling here to Santiago was, it was about 10 pounds over the weight. And because it was 10 pounds over the weight, I had to pay an extra hundred dollars just to travel with my bag. So a tip to all of you guys who want to be traveling, don't use a massive bag. If you can try to get a big backpack that you just have, don't even put anything under the plane. Use a big backpack, kind of like a, uh, hold on one second. Kind of like a bag like this, which is pretty much a massive bag, which you can pack as much stuff into it as possible. And this one is like a backpacking bag. This you can bring on the plane with you. You don't have to check in and under. So if you're doing short domestic flights, you don't have to pay extra and you can just literally bring it on as a carry on. That is what I would recommend. Don't overpack because you would be surprised while you travel, you actually use way less than you were thinking of using. Even though I have this massive bag, I'd probably wear the same three pairs of jeans and the same few shirts throughout the whole time I'm somewhere and I just keep watching them. You guys know I stick to all black, pretty much the outfit. So why I have that whole bag, I have no idea. But now we are trying to scale down a little bit with these kind of bags just because it's getting very expensive. So that's my tip to you guys when traveling. Try to think small, compact, and try not to pay that extra weight fee because it's ridiculous. If you're doing a short flight, it often is the same price as that short flight. Totally not worth it. With that said, guys, I'm going to end the video off here. Santiago, Chile, what's good? We're here for a while. I'm excited to be back. Crazy stuff planned. So with that said, I'm going to end it off with the normal keep being a wolf, follow your dreams, and I'll see you guys in the next video. See ya! We'll be falling high in the black hole of our universe And the whole world is hot, but we won't know Cause we're too busy loving life